royal bombshell, the one person the Queen dreaded meeting revealed, she felt drained apostrophe. The Queen has met a host of personalities during her 67 year long reign, but according to one expert, Her Majesty dreaded meetings with one particular royal. Suffering her worst year as monarch, in 1992 the Queen had to deal with several scandals including the separation of the Prince of York from his wife and the release of Princess Diana's book. Within Diana's book, she spoke of her former husband, Prince Charles' affair with Camilla Parker Bowles. Diana and Charles ended their relationship in 1996 but in the lead-up to that, the once Princess of Wales used to visit Her Majesty to speak of her troubles. Writing in her book, The Queen and the, the Untold Story, Ingrid Seward revealed that the Queen apparently came to dread meeting with Diana. M. Seward writes, the Queen came to dread these meetings with her daughter-in-law. They left her feeling drained and despondent and confused, an uncommon state for a woman accustomed to the certainties of her position. As a result of those taxing meetings, M. Seward also revealed that Her Majesty began to meet with Diana less and less. This was, however, not out of jealousy, something Diana interpreted it as. However, the Queen did once give a withering response to an onlooker when they spoke of Diana's popularity. Diana married Charles in what became one of the most watched events around the world. According to estimates, 750 million watched the event and such was Diana's popularity that Tony Blair once described her as the people's princess shortly after her death. Speaking of the Queen's response to one courtier's remark on Diana, royal author Penny Jr. spoke of the event in her 2005 book, The Firm. She writes, Diana's popularity was phenomenal but it was not the first time that the nation, or indeed the world, had fallen in love with a beautiful royal princess. When the mania over Diana was at its height, one of the Queen's courtiers said, Ma'am, you will never have seen anything like the publicity Charles and Diana are having. You were not around, she said witheringly, when Margaret and I were having our future husband's talent spotted for us.